Hi guys and welcome at a new episode of building Geonosis. Last episode we finished this beautiful catacomb area. I'm really happy and glad how, with how it turned out. In this episode we're going to take a look at the droid factory. So this part of our miniature model. I don't really know what and where I'm gonna put uh, certain things like the conveyor belt etc but those things we'll see throughout the episode I think this episode will be a lot of experimenting because I don't really have a plan for the droid factory as of yet so uh, I'm pretty excited to start building at the droid factory so let's get right into this week's episode let's take a look first at the source material the source material isn't that clear always just because the droid factory in the movie is a really dark place so like you guys can see on these pictures it isn't that clear all the time also there's a lot of detail in a lot of really small things so it's kind of hard to recreate it perfectly in legos but we'll make it work main focus this episode will be the first conveyor belt the first thing i did was trying to come up with a nice design that looked good and was pretty detailed for the droid factory it's a sort of pillar design the things that i included are those orange lights because you can clearly see those on source material so that's the only thing that I really try to recreate as well as the top part of the pillars on the source material I did my best I think and I'm pretty happy with how these pillars look so we can definitely use those in the mock The second thing I did was starting to work on the conveyor belt itself. The first conveyor belt of probably maybe three I think, three in total in the factory part would be already pretty nice. But like you guys can see I think I captured it pretty good and I'm uh, really happy with how it looks so far. I also added inverted slopes on the bottom to make the conveyor belt itself look a bit thicker. I think it's normal for a conveyor belt to be a bit thicker because underneath you have all those gears etc for the conveyor belt itself. So it makes sense that it isn't just one plate. So I made it a bit thicker. At first I wanted to put the conveyor belt up in the air on those pillars I just made earlier but didn't feel right. So. I changed my mind and I put the conveyor belt on the ground at the end of the base plate so at the end of the droid factory this looks way better in my opinion and I can't wait to continue building. I'm really happy with how it looks so far it looks really good to me and I think it was a great choice to put the conveyor belt there at the end of the base plate now I'm just going to add some gribbling at the sides and make it look pretty and this is where we end up after the gribbling looks really good to me I like the clean look of it and the small details that I included by using some printed tiles as well as some pipes and all sorts of things i'm really happy with how this looks this is where i'm going to end up this week's episode of building geonosis i know it's a really short one and i'm really sorry for that i just didn't have more time to work on this geonosis mock luckily i have some more free time in the coming two weeks so next episode will have lots of progress and will be a bit longer to make up for this short little episode but like you guys can see i'm really happy with the progress that we made in this episode the conveyor belt looks really good already next episode will be a lot of experimenting i already made some sort of designs uh, for the robotic arms to move them I just <laughs> broke it 
But um, yeah, next episode will be lots of experimenting and working on those machines that will come alongside the conveyor belt. You can clearly see where I'm planning on putting some machines. I'm also working on some side details. You can clearly see these things at the side of the conveyor belt. So I am planning on including those things. I'll put a picture on screen right now so you guys know where I'm talking about. But I'm really happy with this progress. It's not that much progress, but it's really good progress. So guys, if you enjoyed this week's episode of Building Genosis, please let us know by leaving a like or leaving a comment. Subscribe would be appreciated. And uh, we'll see you in the next episode of Building Genosis. Bye bye, guys.